Hello everybody, um, just thought I'd do a quick video on this. I posted about it a couple of weeks ago, um, but I never recorded the video. So what, what it is, is, I don't know if you can see, is a main switch. Um, and basically it gets over the problem of a pump overrun, um, where you can wire one bit down by the boiler, which is this, this they're, they're lovely and little. Uh, they do have like an outer, outer box. I don't know if you can see that. Um, basically, from, from the looks of it, I will continue the video, but you basically put your pump live in and your pump neutral in here. That sends a signal to this one, which is very similar, but has more terminals here. Um, and this and sends a signal to this, which powers your pump from the boiler's pump live. Uh, the bit that goes up in, by the pump has a live neutral nerf, so it needs a permanent live neutral nerf, but obviously in an airing cupboard, you've got that um, by the wiring center and then it's labeled as switch live, but that's obviously what they're, they're meaning as your pump live, because it is a, it's being switched, neutral and earth. Um, and that's it, as, sim as simple as that, man. Um, so I'm gonna fit this on today, well, the, the guys are gonna fit this on today's job, and I will do a video of it in action a bit later as well. So yeah, so it's called a mains switch, and I... Uh, hopefully you can see this okay. Um, basically, this is the bit that goes up in the airing cupboard. So what we've got is we've got a main live neutral and earth, and then we've got a what they've labelled it as switch live neutral and earth. And the SL is what is effectively the bit that goes to your pump. So that will be our pump live. Um, very straightforward. Plenty of room to get your cables in, and obviously they're going to be clipped in um, into the space there. Um, and then that will simply screw up to the wall somewhere, wherever I can fit it. Um, yeah, so so far looking great. So this is the uh, boiler end. So it's simply literally a live and a neutral, but when it says live, it means the pump live connection on the boiler and the pump neutral connection. So literally just two core, again, it's very similar to the one upstairs, all comes nice and together, and uh, clamp to hold it all in. So this is the receiver wired into the boiler, so it's literally just two core cable, which is your pump live and neutral, and that sends the signal upstairs. And then this is the upstairs one, which is wired into your mains, live neutral and earth from the junction box. And then a pump live neutral and earth, which goes from here straight to your pump. And the green light indicates that it is pumping. And then when the boiler cools down and the pump overrun goes off, the signal will be lost to here and the pump will turn off. So as you can see from the video, it's all installed. Uh, overall, I'm very impressed with it. Build quality feels very good. Uh, ease of installation was very, very good. Um, yeah, so I would definitely recommend it.